Now, the latest attempt to reintroduce the Great Bustard to Britain is underway on Salisbury Plain. Soldiers are helping to extend a pen over several acres in the hope that this year the young birds will breed there. The Great Bustard was once a familiar sight in the skies over Britain, and the hope is it will be again. Chris Conabeer reports. Spot the birdie. We tried, and the Great Bustard is here somewhere, we're assured, on the military ranges of Salisbury Plain. Today, they were keeping their heads down. Though last time we filmed, this is what we saw. Chicks from Russia brought here to breed, and they've almost managed. Things are looking good. The females are in good condition. There was an attempted mating last year. The eggs were a good size and so on. The birds are just one year older now. Fingers crossed that this year, we hope, will be the first successful breeding of great bustards. Today, soldiers from the Highland Gunners, recently back from Afghanistan, were helping to extend the breeding pen which keeps predators out. It's something new. Twitch is always asking for new things to watch, so... <laughs> no, it's, um, obviously you say it wouldn't extinct. It was one of our sort of bigger, or large, probably was the England's biggest bird, apart from the swan and everything else. But uh, I think it's a pretty good idea it's being released, yeah. Coming there, seeing the size of the pens and that, no, and I've got a lot of work to do, it's quite good. And uh, seeing as we was blowing up Salisbury Plain last week, it's good to put something back into it, really. So it's really good. By 1832, the entire Great Bustard population in Britain had been completely wiped out. A combination of changes in farming and the peculiar practice of the time of shooting and stuffing wild birds rather than just watching them. The aim of the project is a self-sustaining Great Bustard population in England, and I think we're well on the way to achieving that. And it is an incredibly spectacular bird. They're extraordinary birds, aren't they? Let's hope the breeding programme is successful.